welcome to the mystery ink racing with me Shaggy Scooby 66 today we are doing a daily race a uh, C in in GT7 here am I um, in, uh, qualified in fourth place up ahead we have Saint Passion in first place um, just race uh, in second so he's starting over the line as we come down to the first corner in third place there and they're going to go through the corner Jack Craig racing just looking uh, yeah, not being able to do any oh, oh someone's there uh, sounds like they're uh, skipping up ahead first two has got away Dexy's just dropping back Shaggy Scooby is back further let's put the display all on I thought I'd, I thought I'd set that before I go sorry about that so the other SC we're, we're at Catalonia uh, it is a little bit of a new saving race um, in the Mazda Tanza it's quite easy to save what you need um, the Mazda is also um, a surprisingly good car but, um, and you, ha you do have to naturally short shift that to get the best out of it. Let's see what's going on behind. Jack Craig Racing picked up the penalty. Let's see if we have a look on the inside. Good racing there, you could have uh, easily put it off. Nicky there closing in on Jack Craig Racing stay in that position he'll uh, be able to go through at the next um, at the next penalty point that's the word I'm looking for as you can see this race is dominated by the attendance oh Spudge Spudge is in the car there everyone on the racing hearts because that's how you have to be on But out front, St. Passion's just pulling away. Um, and he needs to make sure that he's going to be saving a bit of um, fuel. Just going to race his bit of penalty there. He must have cut the uh, first corner. So Dexy's coming up and going to come up behind him. side by side, Shaggy's still in fourth place there there's a nice little battle for, for second place dex has got on the inside of him, goes up to second, nice clean pass uh, yeah, well, well nice, nicely done there Dexy just from races, uh, got that penalty and uh, he's going to he's gonna, do it now so that is gonna drop him into the uh, hands of Shaggy I think there Shaggy goes by easily done so Tuscan Racer's um, done his he's definitely glitching his Tuscan Racer uh, come to some Racer now gather it all together and uh, catch up and just stay on the back of Shaggy Jackie Rock in a uh, Mystery Inc. Um, logo there. I have to say that uh, the uh, graphics in GT7 are so much nicer that that livery just pings if I do say so myself. But as we start lap 3, St. Passion is still out front. He's revving it out though, so he's going to have to surf some fuel at some point. Dexy there. We're on the same uh, strategy at the moment. Uh, just still pulling away from Shaggy in third. Took some races in fourth first. Further back. 
pack has gone ahead of uh, Craig Jack Racing. Oh, that was a late lunge by Craig Jack there. Didn't force him off, but um, that, was a, that was a bit strong. There's back everyone's just... Um, oh, lots of people have dropped out. Oh no, 16, just going through. So, Shaggy's still in third place and uh, he's already dropped to Scud Racer. Out front, Dexy's still there and Saint Passion is out front. Passion and Dex is starting to burn through the fuel. Shaggy and Tuscan Racer, they've, it looks like them two have got a plan. They're on about the same fuel at the moment. Mickey's burning through his fuel. Greg Jack Racing uh, on about the right pace at the moment. Just pop through some of the others. Coming down in a Hurricane Rana there. Seems all over the place. Oh, he picked up a half second penalty and uh, took a bit too much curb. Oh, is Smudge doing in the car there? Smudge is still down in 14th place, carrying a penalty. So we're on lap four. Havoc at the back. Not really causing too much havoc there. Saint Passion's still out front and he's popped in a 55.7, which is a really quick lap. And I'm gonna say it's a bit too quick um, to be saving fuel. Nice and smooth there. He's definitely uh, dropped Dixie. Dixie's picked up a half a second penalty. Is he going to have to um, do it now? No, it'll be the next time round. Tuscan race is still just uh, keeping that gap to Shaggy. But Reptilic uh, seems to be closing in on Tuscan Racer. Mickey there's got Jack Racing behind him and Parker. Bobby but in a uh, Red Bull livery car there. That looks quite nice. Delay race in a uh, Nescaf. Cannon Dam uh, has uh, used his, uh, he's got rid of that penalty, he's still in 11th. Ivan Itch and then Gaggler Car, Smudge and Shiv. And we're down to 15 races now. Have it still at the back. Passion's still out front and on half a tank of fuel. He's got just got a sliver of red on those front tyres. Dexy's just got just a little bit over a half a tank of fuel. He's gonna come and pay that penalty now. So let's see um, if Shaggy can uh, take advantage of this. I do like where they've put the uh, penalty line because you're going to pay for it you pick up a penalty. Shaggy's rarely closed in and uh, it's out for front three. Shaggy's got more fuel. There's um, people in uh, certain Facebook groups saying that you know the race is boring. 
race isn't boring you've got to race to the race um, the rules you can go for a pit or you can uh, not go for a pit oh shaggy now really caught up with uh, Dexy round the uh, round that last hairpin Shaggy gonna look going into corner one no he breaks early he just uh, coasts it round these two are starting to uh, close that gap on St Passion though a lot of fuel then Dixie still ahead but here comes Shaggy got a really good exit and run out of that corner Ooh. bit strong left by Shaggy but didn't really put anyone off uh, then Dixie left the door open and the game hasn't given a penalty so strong move there by Shaggy done to either racer then Dixie's still um, hanging on the back of Shaggy around this area so come up to this uh, heavy braking point and Shaggy just covers the inside line gets it stopped then Dixie can't get around Shaggy at the moment so Shaggy up to second place started fourth got a much better line out of there he's just made a little bit of a gap and St Passion has gone into the pits decided he couldn't make it so we're starting we're starting lap seven as we race down to the first corner TCR Shaggy in front then Dixie behind him then Dixie didn't make a, a move there Shaggy's done well, he's been driving the car really good, he's saved the fuel. Then Dixie's got a lot less fuel. And his tyres look a little bit more worn than Shaggy's, so we'll see what was going to happen here. Rep this, he, he's been promoted into third place and do like that livery on that car, I do like a good animation livery. Craig Racing uh, giving Mickey uh, all the hassle he needs up at the front Shaggy's still in the lead and pulling away a little bit from Den Dixie Jack Craig Racing's got ahead of Mickey sorry we missed that guys Mark is now closing on these two. These two are racing. And uh, that's just allowed Parker to uh, close the gap. Globe is all alone in seventh. They're racing ahead of Cannon Dam. Nusovic in tenth. Smudge. Uh, doing well in the car there. Again, a lot of uh, a lot of glitching going on in the room. As you can see. So Shaggy's now got a nice lead over Den Dixie. Got, has got the fuel and has got tyres right. 
Saint Fashion, after his pit stop, is all the way down in 12th place and a long way back. This is why you just got to drive the car within, within itself. But remember, it's not you're not you're not doing qualifying laps. But they're in 13. Smudge. Oh, picked up a smudge. I think smudge must have gone off. Oh, he's going to go off again. He's having a hard time of it. Is smudge now? But someone who isn't having a hard time of it is TCR Shaggy. Chicane and then round the last corner onto the start finish straight. It's got about three second lead, two second lead now. Putting in uh, constant 56s and 57s, it's probably about the right place. Then Dixie still in second place. Um, but then Dixie, is then Dixie going to have enough fuel? Rep still in third place. And Jack Craig Racing in fourth place. Mickey, Mickey's going to be in uh, fuel problems, I think. Parker's drove well here at the season. So you can see how some people um, are able to manage the fuel, some people are not. Unfortunate for St. Passion there because um, I think he had this race um, won at one stage but decided to pit. It's much there in 13th. So, lap 9 as we uh, go across the back straight. Shaggy's just controlling it at the front now. Shaggy knows he's got fuel. Then Dixie hasn't got fuel. I think he's got enough to do um, the last lap without any problems, but just that early part, just used a bit too much. Shaggy knows he's got a load of fuel, he's just revving the car out now. It's just going to pull him away. Ben Dixie in second place. Rap is coming under serious pressure from uh, Jack Craig Racing there. If I look at the front of Jack Craig Racing's car, he's had a few knocks and bangs. But out front, it's Shaggy. Not a dent on the car. It's the last lap, so you expect the fuel light to be on now. But Shaggy's got this under control. It's all in Shaggy's hands. Then Dixie has raced well. Anyone going to run out of fuel on the last lap? The person has just got ahead of Cannon Dam. These four, these four have closed up. St. Passion in 10th now. Smudge at the back. Shaggy's still got Dan Dixie behind him. Dan Dixie's raced well. Shaggy's raced well. But it's going to be Shaggy that takes the win. This will be the first win that Shaggy's had uh, in GT7 in um, a daily race. So yeah, Shaggy wins. Dan Dixie in second. He's 
you're not just going to keep it? Is he going to run out of fuel on the line? No. Rep in third, Jack Craig racing fourth. Parker's going to come over in fifth with Mickey in sixth. Blowby in seventh. And so our rest of them um, come over the line. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you uh, enjoyed the racing. Give us a like, give us a thumbs up, leave a comment. Other than that, we'll see you next time. This is Shaggy out.